What's going on, you guys? It is the last day of April. It's uh, April 30th, 2021, and Motor Trend just posted an article about the possibility of a next generation Ford Lightning. Um, in the article, it says that it will be an electric variation um, and that it should be the quickest and fastest F 150 and Ford's lineup. Um, which would also mean that it is quicker and faster than the second gen Ford Lightning and the first gen Ford Lightning. Um, and if the Mach E Mustang, the electric version, um, the SUV that everybody has gotten worked up and um, butthurt about, is anything um, to kind of give an idea of what the potential Ford Lightning will be like, I'm excited. Um, I think the Mach-E looks amazing. Um, Terrence <clears throat> at Signature Wheels posted up a picture of one that was lowered on a set of wheels next to one of his clients' um, GT500s on Signature Wheels, and it looks absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, people are already sharing the article saying that's for, that Ford's messed up and Ford's ruining the lightning and all of that fun stuff. Um, I'm currently driving my... 850 horsepower twin turbo platinum f-150 um absolutely love the v8 um it's you can't beat the sound of the v8 if you look behind me a couple cars back there's a tesla um electric's the future and uh yeah you know there's very little information in the article um it's just kind of a Ford rep told Motor Trend to expect a Mach-E, or excuse me, a, a next generation Lightning, that it will be electric. Um, and the way that I read the article, I'm going to go back through once I get back to the house. I'm uh, currently headed to pick up some stuff from paint, but um, it's more than likely going to be an all-wheel drive version as well. Um, so off the line, stoplight to stoplight, it's going to eat. Um, yellow douchebag. Uh, made a video the day before yesterday, um, I believe it was, talking about um, the Mach-E GT, and technology's, you know, electric's the future, unfortunately, um, and stoplight to stoplight, if the Ford Lightning that is being released is electric and all-wheel drive, unless you've got a fully built second gen lightning or first gen lightning or a boosted four wheel drive uh 10r80 pickup truck um you're probably going to get gapped at that stoplight so yeah i'm gonna attach um a couple pictures from the article to the video as well um there's obviously very little information on what's coming as of right now it was just posted today um, it looks like 2023 is the year that it will be released. So I'm sure if it's anything like the GT500 release, you know, we'll see some teasers over the next 12 months. And then from there, it'll be, uh, it'll be released probably the end of 2021. There'll be some, some actual spy photos per se. Um, but I'm excited. So, um, just wanted to make a quick little video, um, to document that, uh, I think that Ford is going to crush it. The Mach-E, like I said, the, Mach, the Mustang Mach-E looks amazing. Um, lowered on some wheels, I guarantee that the uh, next Lightning will as well. Um, more than likely, we'll get one. Um, depending on the price point and options and, and all of that, um, we'll probably end up getting a, a, a third generation Lightning. And yeah, I, I, I'm excited for it and I think it's gonna look sick. And that's just because Ford has progressed with every model truck so far and they look better and better every release. So I'm excited. Um, the next little bit of the video will be just kind of a screen pause of the scrolling on the article for you to look over. Um, and I'm gonna include the link in the description below. So comment below. Are you excited to see an electric Ford Lightning? Do you think Ford ruined the Ford Lightning by potentially going electric? Um, do you think that they'll offer two engine options? Do you think they will throw the 
GT500, 5.2, cross-plane crank, supercharged, 700 plus horsepower engine as an option as well. Um, I could see them doing that and doing what they are doing with the Raptor, having a Lightning and a Lightning R, per se. And yeah, so put in the comment section below what you think Ford's going to do. Boom.